All right, in this lecture, we want to connect all of these buttons and screens and clear button to the code. So basically, whenever an action is triggered on the device, the code knows about it and can process it, do some magic and then pr and then output it on the blue bar right here, okay? So we want the main.storyboard buttons and UI elements, so all the user interface elements to be connected to the view controller.swift. Okay? So we have four by four buttons here, so those yellow buttons, and we have a button for the clear and a label for the number zero that's displayed here. Okay, so let's add all of these. Let's start with the label, that's the easiest one because it's uh, by itself, there's only one label. So let's go to the viewcontroller.swift and create that IB outlet. Okay, so that's an interface builder because that's where we were. So uh, inside of the project, at the end of the first opening curly brace, press enter a few times and start typing um, an at IB outlet. Remember the I, the B and the O needs to be uppercase var because it's a variable that we're creating and we're going to create a var variable called label screen okay and we're gonna say the type it's a ui label okay okay and uh, we have it created now what we want to do is connect that to the uh, main.storyboard so go back to the main.storyboard and let's do the connection so just click on that blue um, bar okay which is the label go to the connection tab right here and in referencing outlet click here and go all the way to the view controller you can go here or you can go there okay it's the same so this time I will go here because last time I, I showed you to go here but I did not show you that you could go here but it's the same all right just let it go and select label screen okay so once you do that you will see that your clear button is now I'm sorry your um, your um, label screen button here is connected okay I'm sorry not, it's not a button it's just a, a label okay you see that it's connected to the view controller label screen all right so let's keep doing this for all of these buttons now I'm gonna go faster because you guys are are familiar with the project and how how you can create IB outlets right so IB outlet again uh, the case is very important it's case sensitive okay so I'm going to call this one button zero for the number zero. OK, and type UI button. All right. Now what I'm going to do is just copy this and um, and just add it multiple times because I'm just going to change the name. So copy it. So select it, copy. And then we're going to paste it um, 16 times. OK, one, two. Three four five now it's going to complain because um, it doesn't have um, um, be because they all have the same name so it's kind of hard for the, the, the computer to understand what's going on but I'm going to stop here and start typing so button instead of zero I'm going to call it one and then two and then three now you don't have to write it like this you can just uh, you can just put a number behind okay eight and nine okay so we have all the buttons from zero to nine okay that's good now we're missing a few we're missing the um, the uh, equal sign the dot okay so let's do them button equal sign okay then we have the button dot okay then we have the plus button plus then we have the minus then we have the um, division okay button division and then the uh, button multiplication right multiply multiplication okay that's good enough Okay, so uh, that's a total of uh, of sixteen button. Okay, so uh, at this point, uh, we're gonna connect them. Okay, we are also missing just one. Let me just add it. It's the clear button. Okay, so button clear. All right. So now that we have all these buttons created, let's connect them to the code. 
uh, from the code to the IB outlet. So go to main.storyboard and let's connect them. Okay, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, let's start with the number zero. So just click here, go to the connection tab right here and go new referencing outlet. Okay and start drag and dropping it right here and select button zero, okay? And keep doing the same one, so this is button, button dot, button dot, then this will be button equal, okay? So you guys can stop watching the lecture if you already know what we're doing right now because we're gonna stop there at the end of this lecture, okay? But otherwise you can keep looking at what I'm doing, okay? This is the button equal, Okay, then the plus. Okay, then button one. As you can see, it's pretty straightforward, right? Then button two. Then button three. Then button minus. Okay, we're halfway done. Button four. Button five. Button six. That's the button multiplication. Button multiplication. Then button seven, almost done. This is the last row. Okay. Then button eight. Button nine. Button division. Okay, and the last button, don't forget the clear button right here, okay? New referencing outlet. Button clear. All right, and that's it. Now we have all of them connected. Now in the next lecture, what we're going to do is um, make them do something, okay? So I'll see you guys in the next lecture.